Okay, I got a pair of boots here. Old pair of boots. Uh, I use silicone caulk on them to seal them up. This stuff gets hard as a rock. But uh, it's an old pair, but it's my favorite pair. So I want to keep them around. But uh, I discovered that I could put screws in the bottom to work as ice cleats. So I've got a couple layers of shoe pads inside there so I don't feel the screws. So I figure I'll show you what I'm doing. Okay, so I bought these screws. You can get a box of these screws at the hardware store for five bucks. Number eight by a half inch. Okay. So, uh, So I think eight is like the size of the top, and then and then they're a half inch long. So I bought these here with the heads because I didn't want the round heads. I thought the uh, those be the octagon head, you know, the square head would bite the snow better. Okay, so the way I put those in, I just happen to have these things. These are called nut setters, and uh, this one's magnetic, so it holds it. Okay, so it won't fall out. And then just uh, put them in the thick areas, and it actually goes pretty easy. So uh, this just dawned on me a couple days ago. I have ice cleats, you know, they're about 10, 15 bucks a shoe, or they're about 10, 15 bucks a pair, but what happens is there's big straps here that get caught on stuff here. I'll, I'll uh, show them to you when we're done here. And uh, it dawned on me a, a few days ago. Is, why couldn't I put tire studs in my shoes? Right? So I looked online and looked on Amazon and the, the tire studs are actually advertised as for tires and boots. It, it actually had boots. Yeah, okay, it, it'll work. The only problem is it's like $30 a pack. And uh, it's a pretty big, pretty big uh, screw that has to go in the boot. So that's when I thought, you know, something like this might work. <clears throat> I'm telling them to get them too long. Yeah, that's why I say <laughs> half inch. I think that's as short as they come. And I got at least two layers of pads in, in the bottom. You know, and you might want to look look for the right pair of boot that has these big these big things sticking out. You know, it might not work in all shoes. It might come through and stick in your foot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I go through plenty of shoes, at least a couple pair a year during the summer. So I always have old shoes around. So I. I don't know if I do this to your main your main shoes, but it seems okay. It, it seems like it works good. So like you know, like in here, I I've got these big spots here. Now, if you're out there rock climbing, you know, putting some heavy weight on these things, it might not work good. But just around the yard. Go out the mailbox and shovel a little bit. I think it'll be fine. I know I slipped on the ice last week and I didn't fall, but I got a nice little jerk backwards. So that that's when I tell you, well, I have to start wearing my ice cleats. So this part, so this part's pretty worn down. I don't know if I'd want to put them back there. Let's see what happens. 
My, my shoe pads are pretty thick in here, so I don't think I'd feel it. Okay, so I won't bore you with having to wash the whole thing, but... This, this thing makes it easy. Okay. So here's, here's another pair that I just did. And you can see how these things stick up quite a bit. So I don't know if I'd put them down in the low spots. That might be cutting it close. But putting them in the high spots, it actually works really good. Probably don't need that many, but I figured I, I might as well use them up. Uh, I don't know how good they do on deck boards, if you walking down your steps yeah. off your deck. Yeah. They might slip on wood. So like these shoes is what I'm talking about. There's nothing really high sticking up, but you can see even if you put them on these, there's plenty of room where it's not going to poke through. But these are fairly new and I'd rather not mess these up. These are some old shoes. So this is what I was talking about with these cleats. You know, these stretch on. They're about 15 bucks for, for two of them for a pair of shoes. And these things get caught on stuff. And pull you over so that's when I was thinking I got to do something different you know these these definitely work great no doubt about it but you know these actually work pretty good so far okay see ya bye